Hi friends, welcome to our channel Be a Wise Investor. Please note, I am not a SEBI registered investment advisor. Contents of this video are for information purpose only. All investments are subject to market risk. If you are not understanding the risk or not ready to face the risk, please avoid stock market investment. We are very much thankful to you all who have shared, supported and subscribed our channel Be a Wise Investor. Please like, share and subscribe this channel. Good evening friends. Census closed at 59,959.85, a gain of 203 points. Nifty closed at 70,786.80, a gain of 50 points. Bank Nifty closed at 40,990.85, a loss of 308 points. Copran has acquired the assets of an APA manufacturing unit of Abhinandan Rasayan Private. Vedanta Board has approved the following. Expansion of rolled uh, product capacity of Balco from 50 KTP to 180 KTP at a cost of 595 crores. Expansion of Balco smelter capacity from 580 KTP to 994 KTP at the cost of 8094 crores. Supreme Petrocom has announced an interim dividend of rupees 4 and fixed record date as 9th November 2022. Hero Motor Corp registers a growth of 20% over the corresponding festive period of financial year 2022. Supreme Petrocom board has approved split of the equity shares with a face value of 4 each to face value of 2 each. The record date for that purpose will be announced later. LIC plans to transfer 1.8 trillion rupees lying in its non-participating fund to its shareholders fund to pay dividend or issue of bonus shares. India's forex reserve fell to 524.52 billion dollars lowest since July 2020. International crude oil price declined after China expanded its COVID related restrictions. Xiaomi sold 6 million devices across categories during festive sales. Flipkart's net loss widens 51% on account of transportation costs. Jeffries has given buy call on Anupam Design with a target price of 1030, current market price 774. JM Financial has given buy call on Crompton consumer, Crompton Greaves consumer with a target price of 470. Current market price is 353.25. Prabhudas Lelidhar has given SBA card a target price of 1013, whereas Motilal has also has given SBA cards a target of 1000 rupees. Again, Dabur India, Prabhudas Lelidhar has given a target price of 645, whereas Motilal as well has given a target of 645. Motilal as well has given a target of 500 for PNP housing finance. Sharecon has given an upside potential of 31% on these five small cap stocks. Amber target is 2530, 24% upside. GNA Axles target 841, 25% upside. KEI Industries target 1895, 15% upside. Laurus Labs target 600, 31% upside. Dixon Technology target 4960, 12% upside. As per the data compiled by Bank Bazaar, AU Small Finance Bank, Ujivan Small Finance Bank, Equitas Small Finance Bank are offering 7% interest on savings bank accounts. Maruti Suzuki has reported quarterly results. Current market price 9492.55, market capitalization 2,84,194 crores. Net profit for this quarter is 2,113 crores. Last quarter it was 1036 crores only. Last year Q2 it was 487 crores. Dwari Gesh shows current market price 92, market capitalization 200,279 crores. Net profit is 7.84 crores for this quarter and last quarter it was 39.7 crores. Last year Q2 it was 39.6 crores. Satin Credit Care Networks Limited, current market price 158.70, market capital is 1,205 crores. It has reported a very good net profit of 57 crores for this quarter. And last year, this uh, last quarter it was 210 crores loss. And last year, first quarter, uh, second quarter it was 11 crores profit. Dr. Reddy's Laboratories has uh, reported a net profit of 1,113 crores. Last quarter it was 1,188 crores. Last year Q2 it was 992 crores. Tata Power Company Limited announced quarterly results and net profit is 935 crores for this quarter. Last quarter it was 885 crores. 
last year Q2 it was 506 crores. Intellect Design Arena Limited announced quarterly results. Net profit 46 crores. Last quarter it was 68.9 crores. Last year Q2 it was 79.8 crores. Vedanta announced quarterly results. It was much less. Last year the net profit for this quarter is 2687 crores. Last quarter it was 5,593 crores. Last year Q2 it was 5,812 crores. Corborandum Universal has announced quarterly results today. Net profit 94 crores. Last quarter net profit 86 crores. Last year Q2 it was 103 crores. Pony Sugars Road announced quarterly results. A very good results reported. Uh, the uh, quarterly net profit is 21.73 crores. Last quarter it was only 2.16 crores. Last year Q2 it was 13.01 crores. First half yearly net profit is 23.89 crores against last year first half net profit of 17.58 crores. Everyday indices net profit 14.73 crores. Last quarter it was 21.85 crores. Last year Q2 it was 31.04 crores. Aztec Life Sciences reported an excellent result. Quarterly net profit reported for this quarter is 18.31 crores. Last quarter it was 11.4 crores. Last year Q2 it was 9.08 crores. Half yearly first off for this year it was 29.72 crores against last year first off net profit of 22.07 crores. Bandhan Bank has reported quarterly results today. Net profit 2089 crores against last quarter it was 887 crores against last year Q2 3009 crores. <coughs> Gross NPA is 7.19 percentage. Last quarter it was 7.25 percentage. Last year Q2 it was 10.82 percentage. Net NPA is 1.86 percentage against last quarter 1.92 percentage and last year Q2 3.04 percentage. Notable shares which reached 52 week high today are Anandraj, Bharti Airtel, BHEL, Canara Bank, Coal India, Cochin Shipyard, Indian Bank, Narayana Kirdalaya, SJVN, etc. Notable shares which reached 52 week low today are Ajanta Pharma, Birla Soft, Land Pharma, Intellect Design Arena, Emphasis, NAIT, Nika, PPL Pharma, Prince Vibes, Trasi Action, etc. Today's most active stocks in terms of volume are Punjab National Bank followed by BHEM. In terms of value are Reliance followed by Maruti. Today in NSE 60 shares have touched upper circuit, 41 shares touched lower circuit and 20 shares reached both upper as well as lower circuit. Notable shares which reached upper circuit are DB Realty, Dhani Services, Dainwala Chemicals, Vinayal India etc. Notable shares which reached lower circuit today are Aram, PropTech, PFS, Cypher Media, PPL Pharma, Liber Tissues, etc. FIs are net buyers today to the tune of 1568.75 crores and DIS are net sellers today to the tune of 613.37 crores. Top 5 gainers in Nifty 50 today are Maruti gained 5.60%, Reliance gained 3.09%, Apollo Hospital Enterprises gained 2.96%, NTPC Limited gained 2.08 percentage. Hero Motor Corporation Limited gained 1.55 percentage. Top 5 losers are Tech Mahindra lost 2.52 percentage. Tata Steel lost 2.45 percentage. Sun Pharma lost 2.24 percentage. Grassing lost 2.23 percentage. DB Slab lost 2.06 percentage. Friends, the next one week I will be on vacation, hence I may not be in a position to post any latest news updates. Only after a week I will post. Kindly forgive and we will meet after one week. These all are the information available with me now for sharing. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you find this useful, please like the video, share it with your friends and relatives and subscribe the video please.